The majority of the swinging community are committed couples interested in having sexual experiences with other couples or individuals. In my experience working with couples in therapy, one partner's interest in swinging can be quite anxiety provoking for the partners on the receiving end of that brand new information. Opening up your relationship can be really scary and the idea of your partner having sex or being intimate with another person can bring up feelings of jealousy and insecurity. So if you have brought up the idea to your partner and they don't immediately respond enthusiastically, don't be surprised. Be curious, be supportive, and above all, do not pressure your partner into doing something that they don't want to do. I frequently see couples in conflict over swinging. One person's angry and anxious and the other is impatient and unsupportive. This part's totally optional. My recommendation is for both partners to approach this topic with openness, curiosity, and respect. There's nothing wrong with being interested in swinging and there's nothing wrong with not being interested in swinging. Vanilla sex is not bad and kinky sex is not inherently better. Shaming your partner for their sexual preferences can have seriously long lasting and damaging impacts on your relationship. So if you're struggling to have conversations about swinging and um, you're unable to be kind and respectful to one another, it's a good idea to see a sex therapist. We can help facilitate a conversation with both parties feel heard and supported. If you can't see a sex therapist, there are tons of great online resources for couples who have a desire mismatch around swinging. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and hit subscribe for more videos.